Well, hi everyone, this is Thomas Kincaid, and I'd like to wish everybody a wonderful Christmas this year. You know, with the new millennium upon us, I thought, how could I celebrate a new Christmas series? I did my Christmas cottage series in the 90s, and for 10 years, I painted a different Christmas cottage. In fact, many of those paintings featured Christmas trees, and I love to paint that image of an outdoor Christmas tree all lit up. What a cozy reminder of the joy that we have at Christmas. Now, when I worked on this painting, I thought this will be a chance to start a new series. The series that I want to do is called Christmas Traditions, and this is Christmas Traditions number one. This painting is called The Lights of Liberty, and it is a painting of Christmas at the first home in America. That is, the home where the first family lives. Now, as I thought about this painting, I was thinking about a tradition that has emerged this century of a Christmas tree to symbolize the hope that is in a free society here in America. Now that Christmas tree has been called the National Christmas Tree and it stands on the grounds of the White House building. And what's exciting about it is that this year, the year 2000, I will be on hand in Washington, D.C. Uh, for the lighting of the National Christmas Tree. Now I intend to present this painting to both the outgoing president and the incoming president at that time. So I would ask the question as I look at this painting, what is the light of liberty? The light that glows within this home, the first home, that is the light of hope for the rest of the world. Because you see, as a nation, we have a chance to use our freedom and our success to reach out to other nations with great hope for the future. And yet also the lights that come from this painting are the lights of the Christmas tree which symbolizes our religious liberties, the freedom that we have to celebrate our faith in this country. Now, the Christmas tree is a beautiful symbol of that. Each light symbolic of a community, symbolic of the homes across America that will be lit on Christmas Eve in safety and in peace. As I worked on this painting, I was very aware of trying to put detail in to the piece to capture the sense of stillness uh, and yet the detail of the historical accuracy of the White House itself. I did a lot of research on the White House and began to paint all the architectural elements in very carefully. And then the detail of the trees with the snow on them suggests the quiet stillness of the evening. Everything is painted very soft focus, except the areas of light that begin to glow out like little jewels in the midst of a darkened background. I really enjoyed painting the light coming from the light posts and also coming from the sky. We see the glow of sunset radiating on that sky over the White House. It was a fun effect to paint. I, in fact, began working on it and it sort of happened on its own. I can never tell where a sky is going, but this one seemed to paint itself. You know, one of the fun details to paint as I worked on this was the flag that is so majestic up over the White House there. And I wanted to capture two things. I wanted to capture the majesty of the White House, the proud heritage of tradition as all the presidents over the years have lived within that beautiful building. But then I also wanted to capture something that it is still a home. It is cozy. Uh, it is not just an imposing tourist attraction. It is someone's home, our president's home, his family's home. So I hope this year you will celebrate your tradition together as a family. For us, we love to decorate the Christmas tree and make it a big celebration. We do that every year with my little girls. Each year it's like the passing of uh, another landmark as we hang the ornaments that commemorate the birth of every one of our children. And then we have ornaments that commemorate each year of their life. And those are hung with care as we celebrate our growing family. You know, as I worked on this, I really think of this painting as a landmark in more than one way. For one thing, I've never painted the White House before. And as someone who has painted the concept of home so many times in my work, uh, to paint the home that really is the foundation of our way of life here in this country uh, was to me a great challenge and a great blessing to have that opportunity to do this. You know, much of what we can look back on as the decisions that affected the future of our country were made in that building. It's a marvelous piece of history all its own. And it might be a good chance for you to share some of that history with your own family this Christmas. God bless you.